Y'all know what I was thinking about? I was riding around through Charlotte. I was at the lake, chilling, listening to some old 90s music. And I'm thinking, like, what the fuck are people single for still? Like, you know, everybody done seen how short life is and how easy it is to just lose a loved one, no matter what age. Like, you know, death don't have no age discrimination. It's coming for all of us. And, yeah, we just sit around like we got fucking forever to be fucking forever it's like single for what what <laughs> to turn up like if you over 40 there is no fucking turn up anymore you turn up twice a year new year's and your birthday that's it that's all you get and and if you part of the a-list of a friend group you can turn up on their birthday so you actually got if you got a lot of friends you got a, a couple of times a year maybe once or twice a quarter where 40 plus you can turn up it's acceptable you know it's like a norm it's my girl's birthday it's my bestie go bestie go bestie and you turn it up with your homegirl then you turn up for your birthday and you turn up for the new year and we ain't gonna do shit <laughs> same shit just go to work raise some kids some stragglers left in the house you know but for those of us whose kids are grown, if you didn't have like a whole lot of shit going on before you got rid of them cheering, what you doing? You started playing bingo yet? <laughs> Actually, bingo is kind of fun. But no, don't get me wrong now. Don't, don't, don't let the old taste fool you. I go to trap bingo. Okay, thank you very much. I'm ratchet. So it's just old. I'm ratchet old. That's and that's the new cool. In case you didn't know, <laughs> just look at Instagram. You know, you keep up with the trends now. On Instagram, everything is on Instagram and TikTok, and it's just a bunch of weird shit now. That's just like, oh my gosh, spare me the details. Just weird shit. Now everybody's cloned. And it's like, okay, man is good, but I just don't think man is that good to clone a human being. Because you're missing one fundamental thing, a soul. Like, you can't replicate a soul. I understand that everything is energy and protons and neutrons floating around at a certain speed. And that's, you know, we vibrate extremely high, which is why we're in, we're in, we can be in constant motion. And other things like, say, a rock is vibrating on a very 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 low frequency and it is you know static i guess it doesn't move whatever that is but anyway y'all i love science science is dope yo for real though so many lectures on youtube i call youtube youtube university i swear there needs to be a graduation from YouTube where people can be like, yep, I learned how to do heart surgery on YouTube. <laughs> and I was able to bring my dog back to life. And I'm very proud of myself. But, y'all can tell I pulled up in the driveway, right? You hear like, pull up in the driveway sounds. The car going in gear. The door unlocking, the seat belt coming off. Hey, that was the seat belt. But it's such a beautiful night. Have you guys ever just been like chilling outside and then you smell the wind or you catch a breeze and it's like a childhood breeze, it's a childhood memory breeze and you're like, oh shit, that day was dope. <laughs> and you're like, ah, take me back, take me back. But just for that day. Cause don't nobody want no whoopings and two-week punishments. We had it kind of rough, y'all. Now that I think about it, I'm like, damn, our parents were bullies. Shit, we got beat with extension cords and hairbrushes and sticks and I mean, literally, you, you have to go out and choose your own weapon. Like in the video game, you gotta choose your own weapon, Mama. Like even in the video game, what I'm choosing your weapon for? If I choose your weapon, I'm bring back a leaf. <laughs> You know, 
But I mean, I got a, I had it bad. I got both. I got a whooping and a two week punishment. So I learned to stay in my room by myself and be quiet. I'm, I'm cool with that because I did it my whole life because I stayed in trouble. But that damn childhood breeze, oh, or like an old sex night memory breeze. <laughs> Y'all like, that's some funk in the air. No, I'm just saying like, you know how some nights you can just feel the energy of like the past lingering. You're like, oh shit, that just reminded me of that Freak Nick 96. <laughs> I know some of y'all are like, are you on that video? I don't know. I might be. Bitch, I might be. I don't care. Because <laughs> it wouldn't be anything, it wouldn't be anything questionable or anything that I would be embarrassed about because although I was a, a, a stripper back in the day, you would never recognize me outside the club. I look just, you know, I hate to say it this way, like a normal person. But that's the way guys looked at you when you come in there. They'd be like, you don't belong in here. Why? You don't know. I'm a heathen. <laughs> you don't know me. I'm ratchet. But they would just, you know, I look like, I guess, like a girl next door, somebody's auntie <laughs> or some shit like that. I'm like, aunties get naked and get down too. That's why they got kids. Like everybody got a little freak in them somewhere. But, I mean... I don't know, I just ain't really tripping about shit. Like, it don't bother me. I'm not embarrassed about it. I don't really care what anyone thinks. I never have, and I ain't gonna start now. That's not gonna change. In fact, it has gotten worse. I really don't care now. Shit. Like, where were y'all when I was struggling? Fuck. The fuck out of here. Where were y'all? Where were y'all? Huh? Where were y'all's opinionated asses then? <laughs> when a bitch needed ya. Where were ya then? You wanna give somebody advice? Don't give nobody advice that you ain't ever gave money to. <laughs> That's a new rule. <laughs> Let's just make it a norm. Y'all start repeating that. Don't never. What did I just say, y'all? Oh my gosh. Don't ever take advice from somebody who ain't ever given you money. <laughs> it was something like that, but it came out pretty good. Why'd you guys say it backward? I don't know, y'all. I'm just on this vibe right now. Like, I've got childhood memories and walk of shame night memories. <laughs> Man, have you ever thought back about all the people you dated back in the day? And how y'all, and just the breakups? Like, go back to just the breakup. And you scratch your head like, damn, I said that shit. You know you did. <laughs> Evil ass. All Christian and sweet now. No good and damn well you used to cuss niggas out back in the day. We all have that in us. Oh, boy, I don't be really liking them goody two shoes type folk. The one, the goody two shoes church people that have changed. <laughs> so you've changed. <laughs> some, some of us have not. Some of us want to stay the way we are. <laughs> And still love God. <laughs> it's just a fact. It's a fact. Don't judge me. Because as I said, I don't care. <laughs> so go ahead. You know, how about it? <laughs> judge all you want. I'll make more. <laughs> I am so silly, y'all. For real. I'm just, I'm really high off of life right now. It's a vibe in the in the universe right now. <laughs> I know like an earlier podcast I was like, the universe has changed. The vibe is different. It's all funky and stale. And it was at that moment. <laughs> Y'all know energy is a thing. Energy is a thing. Like, you know, you have to shake shake off the blues. Because like when you have the blues, it can have you looking at everything in a negative light. Like everything. <laughs> and everybody. And it might not even be, it might not even be true. It might not even be the case. It might not be that, whatever, you know. So, patience. Patience. Man, that word, me and that word, we don't get along. We do not get along. But I'm learning. I'm learning to be friends with it. Because not being friends with it is a pain in the ass. Seriously, just a pain in the ass. So, we friends now, we kissing cousins, 
Yep, I'm gonna go ahead and be real, real, real patient. <laughs> Cause otherwise, you kind of like, honestly, you're kind of thinking in lack. There's no need to hurry. I mean, now, don't get me wrong. Don't be dragging your feet on some relationship shit now, like, cause ain't nobody got time to sit around and wait for you. That's the difference. Like, ain't nobody trying to rush, but also no one's trying to sit around and waste their whole life on a maybe on an if on a what if on a possibility on a i'm not sure let me figure it out kind of you know like who has time for that <laughs> nobody male or female it's like mm -mm. anyway y'all that's all i wanted to say y'all know i'm so random another one of my little nicknames the most random woman in the world it's kind of a calling card you know self-proclaimed because I am I will string something along and take a couple of turns and sometimes find my way back sometimes I don't <laughs> just is what it is 